Welcome back to Clothes Show TV, I'm Lily Pebbles and I've just been playing around with Bella Pierre Cosmetics and I really love this Go Natural eyeshadow palette. It's got really nice natural eyeshadows in it. But they've also got loads of mineral eyeshadows and I don't know about you but I've got a few mineral eyeshadows in my makeup collection and I don't really know how to use them, they're a little bit intimidating. So I thought today I'd show you three ways how you can use mineral eyeshadows if you're not really kind of used to using them. So the first one is obvious, just using it as an eyeshadow. Um, I'm going to start by using the makeup base all over the eye because when you're using a loose powder, it's quite nice to put a base on because it kind of makes it stick a bit longer. So I'm just going to take this nice bronze shade and a small eyeshadow brush and just take a tiny bit. The pigment's so strong, you hardly need any. And then you can just use that straight onto the lid and it gives a really nice bronze shadow. So that's one way you can use it. But another way that I didn't know about until Bella Pierre told me, which I think is a really cool idea, is if you wet the brush, then you get a really strong foil effect on the eyeshadow. And you can do that with the brighter colours and use it as an eyeliner. So I've got a little bowl of water here. And if you just wet the brush and put it into the shadow, and then you can see here that it gives a really nice foil effect. And you can use that all over the lid and it lasts really well. For a night out, this would be amazing with a gold shadow. And as I said, if you had like one of the brighter colours, you could just use it as a liner. And I think that would look really nice. So those are two ways you can use it as an eyeshadow. You can also use these as a tinted lip balm. So you can take your normal clear lip balm and use a bit of that. And I'm just going to show you on my hand. You can put that on first. And then if you take a little bit of the pink pigment, there's loads of nice pink shades. So you can pick the one that suits you and take a little bit onto your finger or your lip brush and just mix it with the lip balm and as you can see it gives a really nice, this is obviously a really bright pink, this would be amazing for a night out, but you can take whatever colour you want and you can make it as dark or as light as you want depending on how much pigment you take. So I think that's really great, I know I've got a few bright pigment eyeshadows lying around so I'm definitely going to try this when I get home. And those are just a few other ways that you can use mineral eyeshadows. So I hope that helped you. I know I've learned some stuff today. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter. Our Twitter tag is at Clothes Show. And I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.